All right, so I obviously don't know what day it is. <laughs> I don't know how long my twists have been in. So just showing you guys. Um, I, I just know it's been long enough to the point where I need to wash my hair, but I don't feel like it just yet. So I'm gonna show you how I refresh my hair until I decide to actually wash it. But just water, oil, just use this. This actually allows me to get moisture into my hair. Sometimes my hair just needs some moisture. My scalp just needs some moisture. But um, yeah, this is actually the quickest way that I do it. Um, I have been cutting on my hair. Um, yes, I have. Um, just to kind of balance it out a little bit more and cut it short and allow it to grow weird thing so it was just too long so i cut it down and then it was just too long in certain areas so i cut it down some more and then i let it grow a little bit more to this which is pretty much the length that i like it so probably tomorrow i might take some time and uh i might take some time in line myself up my hairline and everything up a little bit more but yeah this is how i get some moisture into my hair just water and extra ver is it extra virgin olive oil? coconut oil is in here you can also use this i just purchased this so uh, this is the um coconut um oil hold and shine uh spray from cantu shea butter so this works pretty good for me too. So I'm gonna use that as well. <laughs> ah! What happens when you get stuff from Walmart, right? So what this stuff actually does is it actually defines my curls, especially when I use a sponge. Now, someone said that they have a problem when they use their sponge that it separates or creates clumps. Um, of curls or defined curls in their hair that's what you want it to do um it doesn't work like that for everybody um i know my preferred way or the way my hair is is what most people want it to look like but um don't worry too much about that um somebody commented helping in that person saying that if you just use a pick uh, to kind of lift so that you won't see your scalp because that's usually the issue that people have is I can see my scalp after I use this thing you could just use a pick to kind of lift from the roots up but don't lift through your curls because then it turns into an afro so here as usual I always put a little bit more oil in my hair because I really like to protect my hair from heat um, it's just me and I use a blow dryer to stretch my hair. So when you first saw it, it was like shrunken in. But once I wet my hair, it stretches out a bit more. And then to hold the stretch, I blow dry my hair. So that's it. I put a little bit more oil on my hands <laughs> before I start like playing in it and making sure that it's, I guess, styled the way I like it. So I'm not going to... Well, we'll see what I'll show you in the next clip, but <laughs> I, uh, yeah, this is all I do to revive it. This is what I've been doing for the past, I don't know how many days, <laughs> but I like it. Good protective style, easy. I don't have to do a lot when I get up. I don't have to, well, I need to show you guys a wash day, right? <laughs> 